a thing or two about betting and about Derby. He's been studying them this season and, oh yes, I almost forgot, he's already taken them to one title. Could Derby's recent dash up the division be a sign of things to come? The club are in a better position now than they were at this time in 1971 and 74. Then they went on to win the championship. The goals of Kevin Hector signed from Bradford Park Avenue and the leadership of Dave Mackay resurrected after a badly broken leg took the team to the championship in 72. Two signings that illustrated the genius of soccer's greatest management team. Brian Clough, of course, and Peter Taylor made Derby tick over like one of the Rolls-Royce engines made in the city. It was a great side in, in, in a first-class, first division. The present side, in my opinion, Derby's a good side and will get better. Um, and the reason it's a good side... Do you want me to delve on this? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think Arthur's made some fantastic signings. I do, honestly. I rate Wright very highly. Shilton's the best keeper in the world now. And if Saunders comes and does it, there's three great signings. And that's what it's all about. Uh, and that's why, by the same token, you get the Terry Venables, they're in trouble. Not because he's a bad coach overnight. His signings have been lousy. And Cox's best signing, according to Taylor, Peter Shilton. I was in Spain last week, and I know we look at their keepers. They're a joke compared to their children. I look at the present English stock, and I obviously see the continent. And although I've had advocated Shilton to get out while he's at the top, it makes no difference to my views of him. He is without doubt, tonight as I speak to you, the best keeper in the world. The others are pretenders. I'm sick of talking about Shilton, you know, but if you compare the Arsenals and Liverpools with their keepers, they should be coming down to the baseball for lessons off for Peter. Is that far advanced? And that's one reason why I put my money on Derby. They'll have the best defensive record of the season. Make no mistake about that by next May comes round. And that could just tip the balance. I'm not saying they're going to win it. I'm saying they'll never have a better chance. And at 40 to 1 with some bookmakers. Get on tomorrow. Because a couple of more good wins and they'll tumble to 10s.